Hey guys, welcome back to Subnautica. and continuing from where we last left off. We are in the final stretch. We are about around the 840 mark from uh, the Neptune. And indeed, we do have everything we need to finally finish off the Neptune rocket. Now, the reason I wanted to start here instead of uh, like at the rocket is because, you know, I wanted to talk about like all the fun times you've had in this game. I didn't, you know, I just absolutely love it. It's a great game. The sound, the sounds, the music, the, the game, during the day, it's, the, during the day, the game is extremely pleasant, fun, beautiful. Then it gets to night, and, you know, the light goes away, the luminescence starts shining, then the terror factor just starts then the terror factor rises and that's what i love about this game the day is pleasant the night is terrifying because if you're a first timer playing it you know it's the night is terrifying but because i've played this game so much you know the night isn't really holding any terror for me anymore you know, the only thing you have to worry about is the Leviathans. The Reaper, Ghost, sea dra the Sea Dragon. And, uh... <laughs> Do you remember back when I first uh, tried to show you... Uh, I wanted to show you the Sea Dragon... Uh, the Reaper Leviathan over there near the Aurora? <laughs> he, he started rushing at us. I was like, oh, run! Then the uh, we'd get down to the Lava Zone. The... It's like, does that sea dragon see us? Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. It's like, no, 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 run, run. <laughs> uh, a lot of fun. <laughs> it's like, even, even though I just royally hate those guys, this game is just downright fun. The music, like I said, the music is good. The sound effects for all the creatures are excellent. This game has got good story to it, good gameplay, and if you've never played this before, I totally recommend you go getting it and giving it a try. Because it is just downright good. Anyway, that'll be the cockpit constructed. And that'll be the Neptune escape rocket complete. With that, we will be able to leave this planet and beat the game. <laughs> Once that's done, all we gotta do is just head up, initiate all the initialize all the systems. Neptune one rocket online. Thank you. Call it space breaker. And of course we got we gotta color the rocket with our signature color scheme. What color scheme is that, of course? Blue and orange. Last but not least, the rocket name. Hey, what the? Oh, you should be up there. How did that get down there? Ah, excellent. Space breaker. Now we have every now. We can get out of here. 
not really much to see, you know, above the ocean except for the aurora. But we'll say goodbye to our life pod. Goodbye to all our beacons. Go down here and quick. Say goodbye to our sea slayer. Welcome aboard, Captain. It's been with us basically since damn near the beginning of the episode. Because we constructed like maybe two, three episodes. I think we construct. If I remember back, we constructed like two, three episodes in. Uh, then of course came our prawn suit, and he's all the way down there, the deep. But I think that'll about do it, guys. Let's go up to our rocket, initialize all our systems, and let's get off this planet. Come over here to the platform. Activate the elevator. I am on my way off this planet. Now, I don't understand the storage because it's not like you're going to be able to take the stuff with you. But activate communications array. Communications systems array active. Hydraulics online. Pressurizing hydraulics. And of course. Auxiliary power unit online. Prime the CPU. Primary computer systems active. Not gonna really worry about the time capsule. Activate life support systems. Life support systems online. All systems are go for lift off. Well guys, here we go. So now we can leave. So now I won't pl pl go all the way through. Once we, uh, you know, once we hit space, I will end the video there. I just want to say, uh, you know, to avoid like the ending music. So you know, you know, you could probably guess why. But you should definitely, uh, if you want to hear the ending music, you should check it out. It's pretty good. I, I have it downloaded on my phone. So when I listen to my music, I'll listen to it every so often. It's called Abandoned, Abandoned Ship. You check my actually my music player right quick. Make sure I got that right. Uh, where is it? Yeah, abandoned ship. It's about a minute and forty long. So yeah, be sure to give that. Be sure to give that little. And it's not. It, there's no words. It's just music, and it's actually it's very good. But anyway, guys, here we go. Activating all systems. Prepare for launch. Ready to launch on your command, Captain. Three, two. Launch in ten. No, nine, never mind. Eight. Seven, Birds, you might want to move. Six, five, four, three, two. Here we one. go. Feel the power. Time capsule jettison. <laughs> We're out of the atmosphere into space. Caution approaching orbital debris field. Uh oh, this is how I woke up on this planet. Oh, hmm. orbital debris field clear. 
performing gravity turn maneuver. And we get to see the planet one last time before we <laughs> say goodbye. Well, planet, sorry to jet, Confirm but I'm in a hurry. Coordinates. Nearest interstellar phase gate. Beautiful, isn't it? But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Please be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all for the next game. Goodbye!